Today we're going to talk about private mortgage insurance or PMI and how to get rid of it. Hey, it's Doug Carey, real estate agent. Today we're going to talk about how to get rid of private mortgage insurance. It's very expensive. It's not adding to your wealth in any way. It's like throwing money at rent. Today we're going to talk about the steps of getting rid of it today earlier than the mortgage company wants you to. Today, now more than ever, we can get rid of our mortgage insurance early because of the massive appreciation that we've seen on our homes. Some homes have gone up 30, 40, 50% in the last five years, but yet we're still paying for mortgage insurance. So here's a couple steps on how to get rid of that. First, call me and I'll give you an idea of what your home is for. So we can look to see, do you have 20, that 21% equity in your property or more to make sure this all is worth it for you contact your lender and they'll refer you to their private mortgage insurance department. That department will talk to you about the ways to be able to reduce or drop that private mortgage insurance. And the first thing is they'll have an appraiser come out and look at your home if it's close. Second, they'll go through the different stipulations, making sure that you fit the conditions that they require. Most of it's you got to have less than you got 20%, 21% equity in the property. If you have any questions about this at all, feel free to reach out to me. I've helped quite a few clients recently drop mortgage, private mortgage insurance off their monthly mortgage statement and save hundreds of dollars, which would have gone on for many, many years. Thanks for watching. I'm Doug Carey. Uh, feel free to reach out with any questions.